Hello everybody, this is Aqua Tammy and we are back with the Hunter McNally babies. And you don't need to do that either. No, I've got him food right there. Right there is his food. He's crying about it, but I don't want to hear it. What I want you to do is come release the ghost. I never do this, but I want you to release the ghost to the netherworld. They mean nothing to us and I'm tired of dealing with them. So go release the ghost. You go get your food. Um, did I tell you what we were doing? This is Aqua Tammy. We are back. This is 100 McNally Babies. This is part number 189. I just jumped right in there because the kids are just being kids, you know. Release the spirits. Yes, please. Release the spirits. Yes, please. Did you release the spirits? We can just put these back out here and we hopefully won't get haunted anymore. I mean, I don't care if I have urns as long as nothing's coming out haunting us constantly so that I can't even fast forward the game for the haunting. Okay, now you are pregnant, right? No, no, no. You're not going to do that. You're going to cook because we're out, running out of food. Yep, she's got morning sickness, so she's got to be pregnant. Okay, um, serve breakfast omelets. Uh, I know you're hungry, but we need food. We're running low. All we've got is, like, garlic noodles. That's, like, all we have left. So, you... you Need social, um, yeah, that's an issue. Why don't you, oh, no, because it's 6.30 in the morning. You are in bad shape. As soon as you finish that, I need you to come and go potty. And you're in such bad shape. And then I need you to work on your imagination. Because that's all I need before I can age you up. Okay. We'll get you aged up. It's Saturday. Which is a good day to age up kids and get them all skilled up. Go, go. Paul. I forgot for a minute. Paul and... <sighs> Patrice. Patrice needs social, but first we're just going to get you some hygiene. And then after that, we'll get you to call your brother, call your other brother. Maybe that'll get us. And this dude is still in our house. We haven't killed him yet, though we ought to. <sighs> we haven't locked him in yet, though I ought to. He's going to get food. A little pain in my backside. I can't remember whose father he is. Probably Quinn Kalidas. Quilita? Yeah. Gotta get that name right because I might be stuck saying it for a very long time. Okay. Now you're awake. You could use some breakfast, so why don't you come grab a serving? Just whenever you get in the mood. No, don't call your mother. No, don't call your mother. You walk in there. Oh, look at your pretty shirt. You're a big girl. You are a big girl. Walk in there and grab you a serving. Okay, you... Did you call? You must have called. 
Let's do a little bit more calling. Call Nick in chat. Call Nigel in chat. Then where is your skill at? You're level four. Then you can practice. Okay. Okay, let's put the omelets up. Let's clean up after your sorry self. Oh, Binja. Whose father is he? Is he? Is he your father? No, your father's dead. So she is your. He is your father. Father. I know you're tired, but look. If you get that far up, I can age you up, and you can sleep in a decent bed. Puking in the bush again. All right, come in here and clean this. We're about to be able to age this kid up. I'm pretty sure. Um, our silly hamburger cake. Come on, you. Come on, Paul. This is what I care about. I care about you getting that skill up to three. I'm not cheating skills. You have to earn your skill. Come on, Paul. Come on, Paul. Oh, for crying out loud, Paul. Finally, finally, you can stop that. Don't be mean to her, even though she's being annoyed. Help blow out the candles, Paul. Now she needs thinking and potty and movement. You need to go potty? Barely. Go potty. And do some thinking for me. Sweetie, I can't stop right now to let you in, but if you want to walk in, feel free. I have to age this one up before my brain rots. Oh, I'm going to need my randomizer and I do not have it open. Let me get my randomizer. Same for randomizer. Come on, internet, be faster than that. There we go. What was this about? Did it not work? Oh, he has to pass out. Add birthday candles. He had to pass out. <laughs> Syrupy. Add birthday candles. It's fine. We'll wait for the little boy to wake up. Come and let your son in. Bite him in. Yeah, yeah.
And then come in here. Help blow out the candles. Paul. Paul, do not even try my patience. Paul. Do not try my patience. Dag, dag. You are going to spin and you are going to age up. Do you understand me? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, that just figures. Oh, Paul is a whiz kid and he is gloomy. <laughs> And he is exhausted. And I think you can claim that bed. You have to come and put birthday candles on my cake. I know. Where did the birthday cake go? Did it go into where it was supposed to go into? Or did it poof in out of existence? Okay, it's in the fridge. You need a shower. You are still on the potty. Now you're sad. You need fun. You're going to do that. So all is good. You're going to sit in the puddle? Okay, you sit in the puddle and do that. Didn't I tell you to take a shower and he's filled this up so he doesn't know what else to do um, and then you can sell and sell and sell nowhere near aging up. How pregnant are you? Because I can't remember. Third trimester in zero minutes. So we are going to have a baby in the next part. Are babies incoming? So we're in the third trimester, so somewhere around two, a little before two, we will be having a baby tomorrow. You are in good shape, so, you know, whatever you want to do. Here. Who is this? Jacob McNally. Come invite Jacob in. Come on over. It's Saturday. You're welcome to come. To come in. She is sad, but she's working on her skill. But I don't have a bar, which upsets me because I can't tell how well she's doing. But she's doing. She needs a shower. We'll give her a shower later. There's not... Would, would there not be in so many Sims? Sure. Talk to your daughter. When you wake up... Spread some juicy go gossip about Iona. Well, okay. Won't you? 
You're gonna go paint. Of course you are. You should really be going now. <laughs> oh, it wasn't finished. Festival. No, thank you. Oh, yeah, the horn. Okay, you can take a potty break. Let's take a potty break. Then get back at it. Oh. You're awake? You didn't use the bathroom like I told you to use the bathroom. that dude getting tired <laughs> please don't talk to him I really don't want you talking to him just want you to sell these paintings. Sell that one too. And why don't you come down here and serve some dinner? Serve dinner. Um, I want you to serve some dinner. Mr. Tortellini. Did you? Are you going to do what I asked you to do? Thank you. Thank you. I know she's got problems. But she's adorable. And... Stop doing that and let's go potty again. Mom's making something to eat. Oh, you are cleaning up the plate. Good, good. Then you can start practicing. Angry, but you've got to use the bathroom and eat before you go to bed. That's just the way it is. Potty level two, excellent. I think you've got everything to level two, right? Right, so we just need movement, potty, and thinking. We're not that far from getting you aged up. We're so far. So, so far. So, so very far. But, but we're getting there. Just need some movements, potty, some thinking. So we'll work on it. 
but it'll be tomorrow. This meal is taking entirely too long for her to fix. I was going to let her eat that, but you're taking so very long to fix it. And she needs a bath. But she can get a bath later. food sweetie no you're not going to bed you're getting food first your mother's almost got it I think I think your mother's almost got it yep see look she's pouring food now and you can grab a serving are you hungry at all no let's get her a let's get her fed Singles night. No, thank you. I'm kind of pregnant at the moment, so singles night would be wasted on me. Let's see. You haven't filled up my things yet, have you? You filled up one. Don't even. You are not going anywhere. You are taking care of your daughter. Won't you just come over here and sit beside her, Miss Pregnant Lady? We'll wait on her to eat. I don't know if she's got energy for a bath. I'd like you to give her a bath tonight. But we got to get her fed first. First and foremost, we get the baby fed. Everything else, she looks like she's going to pass out. Mm -hmm. Three hours. Would you stop it, Mary? Get back over here. We're waiting for her to finish. Now just sit down. Just sit down and be patient. You don't even look pregnant from the front. Except for the big boobage. No. She's almost done. Look, she's putting her plate down. She's putting her plate over here where they always put their plates. And give her a bubble bath. Just give her a bubble bath. Please. Please, please. Why did it cancel out? Ugh. Give her a bubble bath. Why are you asking? Just pick her up and carry her in there. She's going to pass out two hours. How long does it take to give a bubble bath? Take her out so she can pass out. That'd be my guess. Yep. Didn't even finish the bath, did we? Well, we did actually. Where are you going to pass out? All the way around the house? 
She's got to go all the way around the house so she can pass out. Oh, my Lord. Child. Mary. 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 Never mind. Put the baby to bed. See if you can't put the baby to bed, okay? You need to grab something to eat. You just need social. Alright, let's get the baby put to bed. Baby in the bed. Putting her to bed or what? Are you going to bed? She's listening to sto Why is she not going to bed? Why is this not working out? There you go. Crawl under the covers and listen to the story. Switch characters, switch, 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 switch. There we go. When you finish doing that, we're going to serve some more food. I guess we're going to cook. Uh, roast tofu chicken. Or roast chicken. We don't have any vegetarians in the house. Or we could do casserole. Just some roast chicken. Maybe you have a craving. Well then go to sleep. Use the bathroom first though. Use the bathroom. And go to sleep. It's not that complicated. Patrice. Seriously, just just do it. His schedule is completely off. Everybody else. Well, on that note, I think we're going to end this episode. We'll get Mary fed and in bed. I think she's tired. Yep, she's tired. So we'll get her fed and then in bed. We'll let him stay up since he's not tired. And we'll pick back up in the morning. So thank you so very much for watching. I hope that you've enjoyed. And I hope that you will see come back to the next part where we have the next little McNally baby. So have a good one, guys. And I'll see you soon. Bye.